Greetings and welcome to everyone. I'm Amir Hussein, Professor of Theological Studies and Faculty Advisor for the LMU Chapter of Alpha Sigma Nu. I'm delighted to serve as your Master of Ceremonies for today's virtual induction ceremony and celebration. Today, we will induct 109 undergraduate, graduate, and law students into Alpha Sigma Nu, the Honor Society of Jesuit Colleges and Universities. We will also confer honorary memberships upon five distinguished members of the LMU community. We are sorry that because of COVID-19 protocols, we can't have this ceremony in person. We begin with the induction of five candidates selected from the LMU community for honorary membership. Each honorary inductee embodies the Alpha Sigma Nu ideals of scholarship, loyalty, and service in their roles as educators, researchers, administrators, and stewards of the LMU community. I would now like to invite LMU's Executive Vice President and Provost, Dr. Thomas Poon, to read a brief bio of each of our honorary members. Thank you, Professor Hussein. At this time, I would like to recognize the following honorary candidates for induction. Reverend Wayne Negrete, SJ, Assistant Director, Center for Ignatian Spirituality, and Chaplain, Loyola Law School. Father Negrete graduated from LMU in 1980, earning a BA in political science. After entering the Society of Jesus, he was ordained a priest at Sacred Heart Chapel in 1991. He has served as Assistant Director of the Center for Service in Action, where he helped in developing the center's mission and strategic plan for community service immersion experiences, service learning, and social justice. Father Negrete has been honored with the Star Award from Blessed Sacrament School and the Madonna della Strada Award from the Ignatian Volunteer Corps in Los Angeles. Ellen Ensher, PhD, Professor of Management in the College of Business Administration. Dr. Ensher is an expert in mentoring, recognized in 2018 as one of the uh, 100 top leadership speakers. In 2017, Dr. Ensher was LMU's Professor of the Year for Excellence in Teaching. She is the co-author of Power Mentoring, How Mentors and Protégés Get the Most Out of Their Relationships. She has published over 50 articles and book chapters in journals, including the Academy of Management Perspectives, the Journal of Vocational Behavior, and Leadership Quarterly. She has consulted for many organizations, including the City of Los Angeles, Leg Mason, Sisters of the Holy Cross, and the United States Navy. Lily Kajavi, PhD, Professor of Mathematics in the Seaver College of Science and Engineering. Dr. Kajavi's scholarly activity lies in the intersections of mathematics and social justice, and in broadening participation in the mathematical sciences. Her research includes a focus on policing and the issue of racial profiling. And in 2020, she was appointed by California State Attorney General Xavier Becerra to the Racial and Identity Profiling Act Board. She has co-chaired the Infinite Possibilities Conference, a national research and mentoring conference aimed at supporting women of color in the mathematical sciences. Dr. Kajavi serves on advisory boards for Building Diversity in Science, the Mathematical Sciences Research Institute in Berkeley, and SPECTRA, an association to support LGBTQ plus mathematicians. William Parham, PhD, professor in the counseling program and interim director of the doctoral program for social justice in the School of Education. Dr. Parham is a licensed psychologist board certified by the American Board of Professional Psychology, who has devoted his career of service to clinical, educational, training, administrative, and organizational consultation venues. He is a past president of the Society of Counseling Psychology of the American Psychological Association. For most of his professional career, Dr. Parham has focused on working with athletes across levels and across sports. He has also worked with performance artists in drama, theater, and music. Currently, he serves as the director of the Mental Health and Wellness Program of the National Basketball Association. 
In addition, Dr. Parham is a member of the Mental Health and Wellness Task Force of the United States Olympic and Paralympic Committee, the USOPC. David Sapp, PhD, Dean of Graduate Education and Vice Provost for Academic Affairs. As a specialist in technical writing with expertise in civic community engagement and social justice, organizational communication, and educational program development, Dr. Sapp has conducted field work along the US-Mexico border, as well as in Brazil, China, and Cuba, along with archival research in Uruguay. At LMU, Dr. Sapp collaborates with colleagues across campus on a variety of matters vital to the success of undergraduate, graduate, and continuing education. Because of their work with and for our students and our university, and for their contributions to our society and to our world, on behalf of Loyola Marymount University, I am pleased to present these candidates for honorary membership in Alpha Sigma Nu. Please join me in congratulating them. We will now proceed with the induction of student members. The women and men we honor today come from every academic unit, graduate and undergraduate, the Westchester campus and the law school. They have been selected because of their outstanding scholarship, service, and loyalty. To prepare and welcome those who we are about to induct, I now invite our student officers, Nicole Villa, Nicholas Yo, and Anna Horvath, to explain in more detail the meaning of these standards. The first standard is scholarship. This standard will be explained by LMU Alpha Sigma Nu President, Nicole Villa, a senior biology major. Scholarship is the most important qualification for membership in Alpha Sigma Nu, as this tenant reflects the primary purpose of higher education. According to our national bylaws, every year, the top 15% of the student population are invited to apply for membership in Alpha Sigma Nu. Only 4% of juniors, seniors, and graduate students are accepted each year, making membership highly competitive. But strong academics are not enough. Service and loyalty are also essential. I now call upon Anna Horbath, LMU Alpha Sigma Nu Vice President and a senior biology major to explain the standard of service. St. Ignatius said that love is shown in deeds, not merely in words. And so service to others is an integral part of the philosophy of Jesuit education and thus of Alpha Sigma Nu. For this reason, a distinguished academic record alone is insufficient for admission to Alpha Sigma Nu. There must also be a proven dimension of willing and generous service to others, demonstrated by giving freely of time and talent to the academic community and beyond. Service means a proven concern for others demonstrated by activities in support of the institution or the community. Alpha Sigma Nu expects its members to translate ideals into actions as lifelong leaders and as contributors to the building of a just and decent world. I now call upon Nicholas Yeo, LMU Alpha Sigma Nu treasurer and secretary and a senior biology major to explain the standard of loyalty. As defined by Alpha Sigma Nu, Loyalty means a demonstrated commitment to Jesuit ideals of higher education, intellectual, moral, social, and religious. To be loyal to these ideals means to develop a deep sense of decency and a responsibility to truth and justice. This can mean going against the grain of our society or embracing unpopular positions. It entails a high level of personal integrity, a commitment to sound moral convictions, and an abiding effort to advance the good of society and the well being for all. Thank you, Anna and Nicholas. Candidates for membership in Alpha Sigma Nu, the standards just explained are those by which you were judged worthy of membership. As they have determined your selection, so will they serve as a beacon for your future. Today's newly inducted members will be expected to join those who are already members as they commit their imagination and their energy to address the needs and concerns of the world around them. They'll join the company of other honorable and extraordinary men and women who have distinguished themselves from their peers through their intellects, their values, and their actions. Before we proceed with the induction of our newest student members, I have the happy task of conferring an award. Each year, the National Office of Alpha Sigma Nu provides funding for a scholarship to be awarded to an outstanding member from each chapter. 
By working with the Office of Financial Aid and by carefully considering their detailed application statements, we have made a selection from among our many outstanding new inductees. We are pleased to announce the recipient of the $1,000 Alpha Sigma Nu Scholarship. The winner of this year's Alpha Sigma Nu Scholarship is Guillermo Gonzalez. Guillermo, congratulations. Guillermo is a recording arts major in the School of Film and Television. He is the co-founder and co-facilitator of the First to Go Peer Mentor Program at LMU. He is also a mentor in the El Espejo Mentoring Program. In addition to his academic achievements, in his essay where he described his service experience, Guillermo wrote, and I quote, I strongly believe that future generations are just as important, if not more important, as my current generation, because our future depends on it. Dedicating two hours of my day to mentor middle school children made me learn about myself and cherish my own experience. I get to be open about my life and answer any questions they have, be it about college or life in general. Being a college student is truly a privilege and an honor. And with this experience, I can help inspire others to do my part in uplifting the future generation. His essay was not only inspiring, but also a fine reflection of the Alpha Sigma new values of loyalty and service. Guillermo, on behalf of Alpha Sigma Nu, I'm pleased to award you a $1,000 scholarship for academic year 2021-2022. Congratulations on a well-deserved honor. Since we are doing our celebration virtually, your certificates, pins, and medallions have been mailed to you at the address you gave us. The deans of each college and school will read aloud the name of each student inductee. Without further ado, let's get our students inducted. I would like to invite my dean, Dean Robin Crabtree, to introduce the candidates from the Bellarmine College of Liberal Arts. It gives me great pleasure as an Alpha Sigma Nu member myself to present the candidates for induction into Alpha Sigma Nu from the Bellarmine College of Liberal Arts. Here are their names. Kayla Chang. Michelle Chernikova, Mason Cooney, Lucy Everett, Alan Flores, John Fogg, Michaela Galeski, Riley Shavats, Nicole Hernandez, Victor Hernandez, Alexandra Jacobs, Haley Laha, Lydia Lamb, Julia Lemon, Peter Martin, Jean Maxwell Smith, Riley McCoy, Emma Murphy, Sophia Nodder, Rachel Ostrom, Theresia Portuguese, Taina Rodriguez Berardi, Mary Schimoller, Hannah Stewart, Sarah Takanaka, Sophia Venables, Rebecca Vincent. Thank you, Dean Crabtree, and congratulations to our newest members from the Bellarmine College of Liberal Arts. Let's give them a round of applause. I would like to invite Dean Dale Smith to introduce the inductees from the College of Business Administration. It gives me great pleasure to present the candidates for induction into Alpha Sigma Nu from the College of Business Administration. Tori Anderson Shopey, Kiara, Armstrong, William Barnett, Elisa Babich, Amy Chow, Jason Diani, Amanda Farley, Alexandra O'Hagan Padron, Valerie Olivia, Ashley T, Christopher Wilson. Thank you, Dean Smith, and congratulations to our newest members from the College of Business Administration. Let's give them a round of applause. I would now like to invite Dean Bryant Alexander to introduce the inductees from the College of Communication and Fine Arts. It gives me great pleasure to present the candidates for induction into Alpha Sigma Nu from the College of Communication and Fine Arts. 
Joshua Grissetti, Claire Hockaday, Amanda Martin, Rebecca Seymour, Peter Sullivan, Teresa Uten. Thank you, Dean Alexander. Let's give our candidates from the College of Communication and Fine Arts a round of applause. Dean Alexander is doing double duty this year as the interim dean for the School of Film and Television. I would like to invite Dean Alexander to introduce the inductees from the School of Film and Television. On behalf of the faculty in the School of Film and Television, it gives me great pleasure to present the candidates for induction into Alpha Sigma Nu from SF TV. Gwyneth Bukunas, Alexander Bennett, Guillermo Gonzalez, Harrison Ham, Tomas Kufel, Grayson McKim, Catherine Mena, Sophia Miera, and Simran Parwal. Thank you again, Dean Alexander, and congratulations to our newest members from the School of Film and Television. Let's give them a round of applause. I would like to invite Dean Tina Cho to introduce the inductees from the Seaver College of Science and Engineering. It gives me great pleasure to present the candidates for induction into Alpha Sigma Nu from the Frank R. Seaver College of Science and Engineering. Veronica Becker Parel, Alexa Rainey Batigana, Ashwara Butkar, Haley Jean Dante, Leonardo Garcia Saracedo, Luis Garcia Saracedo, Ian Green, Annie Heckman, Amberly Hershaway, Danielle Herpe, Sui Ching Hu, Daisy Huerta, Heidi Johnson, Ramona Kana, Sharon Kim, Emma Lee Perales, Michael Liu, Isabella Lopez, Elena Martinez, Jack Morrill, Rachel Malak, Sarah Nguyen, Lucille New, James Rowe, Alexandria Scaltrito, Megan Talbert, Kira Toll, Caitlin Trombatore, Julia Trudeau, Trenton Brookhylan, and Leyland Wong. Thank you, Dean Cho, and congratulations to our newest members from the Seaver College of Science and Engineering. Let's give them a round of applause. I would like to invite Dean Michelle Young to introduce the inductees from the School of Education. It gives me great pleasure to present the candidates for induction into Alpha Sigma Nu from the School of Education. Laurel Chavez, Shante Crawford, Summer Dennison, Chloe Ford, Brian Froderman, Christine Gutierrez, Shelby Hall, Madison Ho, Julia Emery, Natalie Janji, Bunny Saavedra, Robert Valesco, Jocelyn Zadziai. Thank you, Dean Young, and congratulations to our newest members from the School of Education. Let's give them a round of applause. I would like to invite Dean Michael Waterstone to introduce the inductees from the Loyola Law School. It gives me great pleasure to present the candidates for induction into Alpha Sigma Nu from Loyola Law School. Keith Cooper, Rebecca Harris, Brendan Malloy, Arena Rechkina, Matthew Tang, Robert Baghini, Lauren Elizabeth Pilchak Wake. Thank you, Dean Waterstone. And congratulations to our newest members from Loyola Law School. Let's give them a round of applause. Our president, Timothy Law Snyder, will now lead us in the Pledge of Induction. 
Professor Hussein, students, colleagues, friends, and new inductees, congratulations, inductees, on being inducted into Alpha Sigma Nu, the Jesuit Honor Society. I ask that you please raise your right hand and repeat the pledge of induction. As a member of Alpha Sigma Nu, I promise to do everything in my power to carry out the ideals of scholarship, loyalty, and service. I promise to be committed to intellectual integrity and the pursuit of wisdom. I promise to be loyal to the moral, social, and religious ideals of my education. I promise to be genuinely, genuinely committed to the well-being of others and active in serving them. I will do all this in light of the Jesuit concern for the greater honor and glory of God. As president of Loyola Marymount University and in the name of the Alpha Sigma Nu Board of Directors, I formally declare you to be members of Alpha Sigma Nu. Congratulations and go Lions! Thank you, President Snyder. Before I release you to continue your own celebrations, I want to extend my heartfelt gratitude to someone very special, the wizard behind the curtain, the master chef in the kitchen, the steady, unseen hand at the helm, the real force behind Alpha Sigma Nu, Ms. Amber Gad, our tireless, our tireless and uber-competent chapter coordinator. Amber's unflagging dedication, attention to detail, boundless energy, and extraordinary care are evident in every aspect of the ceremony. Amber, thank you so much. This would have been impossible without you. I would also like to thank our student officers, Nicole Villa, Anna Horvath, and Nicholas Yeo for their exemplary service and leadership. I would also like to thank the parents, spouses, and families of those who we honor today. We appreciate the many sacrifices you make to give these students the benefits of an LMU education, and we celebrate with you their outstanding accomplishments. I think that does it. Let the personal celebrations begin. <laughs>